This is really something. All right, guys, I'm going to bring your first guy to the stage who plays all over New York City. Please give it up for Matty Goldberg. most successful comedian friend. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are lucky. You had to look at my ass the whole time. What a treat. Don't you guys wish you were sitting there? <laughs> uh, it's good to be here, guys. I, I'm like Mike, I like girls. Yeah. <laughs> girls, girls are weird. They wear t-shirts and like sayings on that don't make any sense. I saw a girl with a shirt that said, you can't afford me on it. I was thinking if you're a hooker, that is really bad marketing. <laughs> Why not just wear a shirt that says, I suck really good cock, but it's gonna cost you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Mike's sister laughed at a cock joke. <laughs> Mike, you're gonna miss New York. New York is the greatest city in the world, right? Cosmic things, <laughs> Cosmic things go on, I cannot explain. I was on the subway in the Bronx the other day and I saw the most beautiful girl in the world. And when I see the most beautiful girl, I let her know by just staring at her real creepy like this. <laughs> Here's the crazy part, I live in Brooklyn. Four hours later, I saw the same girl in a bar 10 feet from my apartment. So now I'm thinking, this is destiny. This is the girl that I'm going to marry. So I knock on the bar window and I give her a little hi, how you doing? <laughs> she calls me in, I go up there, I'm like, hi, my name is Maddie. She looks me straight in the eye, she says, are you retarded? <laughs> Thank you. Soon to be a major motion picture. <laughs> I'm looking for love, people. I'm not gonna find it here tonight. Mike's got too many dude friends. <laughs> it sucks, man. I used to have a girlfriend. I did, I assure you, people. <laughs> it was consensual all time. <laughs> she used to get very jealous, though. She used to think that every girl in the crowd wanted to have sex with me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I feel the love tonight. <laughs> she said, you see the way that girl's looking at you? She's undressed with her eyes. She wants to sleep with you. I'm like, are you going to introduce me or not? <laughs> you enjoying my ass, ladies? <laughs> drunk dialer in the world. Oh. I call everybody. I go from A to Z on my cell phone. And there's certain people that don't need to know that I'm drunk. My rabbi doesn't need to know that I'm so horny. <laughs> that I just took a cucumber in my ass. <laughs> oh. Getting off to a good start. Oh. <laughs> Who's groaning? Grow up. Your father will teach you about that soon. Right? <laughs> So Mike's going to L.A. I want to go there, too. Got a lot of shit going up. I don't give a fuck about that. I just got the shirt on. <laughs> I just see what the fucking thing on my... My dresser's and then I put it on. Right? Don't. Whatever. <laughs> no, seriously, man. Things are good for me. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm blowing up your spot, all right? <laughs> Things are good for me. I'm guaranteed stardom for me in six months. I'll take it further. One year guaranteed, I'll be on the cover of Us Weekly for kidnapping Angelina Jolie's baby. <laughs> yes. Fuck that kid, right? Now, people want to put me in movies now. They do. Well, look, I want a good part. I want a part where I get to like kill bad guys with my bare hands. I get to race fast cars. 
And I'm like, no, man, we have the perfect part for you. You're just going to be this weird dude that goes around and starts sniffing girls. <laughs> and that's not a stretch because I've done that before. <laughs> I'm not one of those weird dudes that can like sniff a girl and guess her perfume and be like, oh, obsession. <laughs> that doesn't take any time. It takes time you follow a girl after she's been in the bathroom and tell her what she had for lunch. <laughs> Thank you for having me, yeah. But when you see a nice girl, you gotta let her know if she smells good, right? I figured this out, I was on an elevator. There was these two girls on a Saturday night, they're all decked out for a nice night in the town. I could even give them a little hi, how you doing? <laughs> I could really creep the shit out of them. <laughs> so I was like, why not ruin their fucking night? <laughs> so, this is what I said, I don't know if this is wrong or not. I said, I want you girls to know you both smell really good. I haven't smelled a woman in a long time. <laughs> And they just see the look of repulsion on their face. I got an erection right on the spot. I want to say, Mike, man, I'm going to miss you very much. Are you a student? No wonder why he's fucking moving. <laughs> Mike's, Mike's circling, I love you very much. Have a great trip. <laughs>